Cleanup and recovery continues today after a train derailment in rural West Virginia spilled diesel into the new river. 10 News anchor Brittany McGraw joins us live in studio tonight to explain what crews have been doing to clear the area. Brittany? Crews have had a big task ahead of them removing the rest of the train from the tracks, continuing to contain diesel fuel that spilled, and removing this huge boulder that caused the derailment. We've been checking with CSX officials throughout the day to get an update on how that work has been going and what's next in this cleanup process. We're told the boulder has been moved out of the way and will need to be broken up into smaller pieces. Crews have also removed all 22 of the empty coal cars that derailed, as well as three of four locomotives. For its removal, crews placed additional spill containment booms in the new river to capture any additional fuel that leaked out, but they'll also have to address fuel that spilled elsewhere. There is some that is on that gravel that you see uh, in the rail line, and we're going to need to go in and excavate all of that gravel to make sure that we get all of the stone and soil that could have come into contact with the diesel fuel. Two of the three CSX workers hurt in yesterday's derailment are still in the hospital with non-life threatening injuries. CSX says they plan to be out at the derailment site for as long as it takes to fully restore that area.